gut. I, I don't think I would have ever thought that gut problems could be caused by breast implants. When I look at this, I think it's chronic inflammation and the breast implant is playing a component. When I look at testing for it, I look at your, your functional genetics. So we're very big on understanding how you detoxify. So everybody has a set of genes for mom and dad, and those genes dictate how you detoxify. Now, if someone has heard of all the fancy people on podcasts who talk about the MTHFR gene yes, and how wildly expensive they've made testing for this, which is a joke. So I'll let you know. We have a company we use that tests for over 250 genes for like 900 bucks, but some people are charging 600 bucks for five genes, including MTHFR, which is just ridiculous. So that's part of your methylation path. And if you have the MTHFR gene, are you more susceptible to breast implant illness, you think? We're in a room right now with everybody doing this show. There's uh, five people. Half of us will have that gene. That is one player. And then how we metabolize vitamin D and absorb it and transport it how we, uh, everybody may or may not have heard of something called glutathione, which is an antioxidant they use it for beauty a lot. They're like, oh, get your glutathione, mm -hmm. a push IV at this, you know, the, the place. 